Hey there guys, got a new light on the market from Spider Farmer to review today. It's their G8600. This is the G series, which is marketed as the cost effective range, which did give me very high expectations for the performance and the quality of this light. I have to say I've been very pleasantly surprised by this fixture. It's um, ridiculously cheap, 860 watt light for less than $600 at the moment. It's on promotion on their website. And uh, yeah, I think you'd be surprised at the performance you can get these days for that money and the quality too. Let's have a closer look. So it's a big fixture. It's badged um, to suit a four x four, which I think is probably a little bit too much for a lot of growers. Um, we tested it in a 5x5 five five under Spider Farmer's recommendations at 12 inches or 30 centimeters hanging height. Um, it just fits into a 4x4. Four you four. can see it's a big fixture. Uh, it's got eight bars. These are all detachable. You can uh, clip them in. It comes shipped with the bars separately and you plug each of them in individually into this main bar here and that main bar connects then into the Spider Farmer driver. Got the usual dimming controls here for daisy chain and um, you can mount this driver remotely which is why we have this coil of cable here. Uh, so nice feature there from Spider Farmer and it's got a nice long mains power cable too to the driver. So nothing, um, nothing sort of economy about this so far I have to say. The um, LEDs themselves, they are uh, a mixture of cool white and warm white bridge looks. Uh, again, high-end LEDs, bridge looks are a good company, US company, and uh, produce ni nice LEDs. I used to use them myself in the cobs. And as I said, a mixture of cool white, warm white, and um, 660 nanometer red. So perfect for full spectrum growing. And uh, yeah, each of these LEDs bars absolutely packed with, um, with LEDs. I think you can see that there. So again, all looking good so far. Um, as I said, big, big fixture. We dropped it into the 5x5 five five at 12 inches hanging height and um, took 100 PPFD measurements across the uh, test area. Let me show you the results now. Quite extraordinary, really, for, as I said, this, this value. So, as I said, uh, 867 watts from the wall and an efficiency, would you believe it? 2.57 PPFD per watt, average 989 micromoles over a 5x5. Now, it is badged as a CO2 light, and 1,000 micromoles is probably a little bit under for that. Um, and you could possibly raise it a little bit higher to get uh, more even distribution. We're running at uh, 1,430 micromoles in the center here and 460 at the corners. You could possibly go up to maybe a foot and a half hanging height and spread, get that spread, and improve that spread a little bit. Um, efficiency would reduce a little bit, but uh, nothing dramatic, probably about 5%. In a four by four, this would deliver an average power of something more like 1500 micromoles at that hanging height. And uh, that really is definitely up into the CO2 range. So I would, uh, wouldn't recommend this for a four x four unless you're gonna have a closed system and running, as I said, with the, um, with the four x four, with the CO2 supplemented. Overall though, I have to say, the stunning light. Um, really, really high quality in terms of the build. Um, nice to put together, easy to put together. It's got remote driver. It's got high quality um, LEDs from Bridge Lux. And uh, yeah, that's what, what is not to like. I um, have to recommend this light, very good. I don't think they should be budgeting as their economic model. I think they could um, maybe go up in terms of value chain on this. 
but uh, that's not really a criticism. The fact that they're underselling this light, um, we can't be complaining about that really, can we? So uh, yeah, very impressed. Congratulations to Spider Farmer. Uh, links below to the, uh, to the product website. As I said, it's on special offer at the moment. So uh, yeah, hope you enjoyed. Please subscribe, hit the like buttons, hit the bell for future notifications and um, leave any comments in the description. Take care.